Hey, hey, so so what's up, man? What you been up to, bro? I've been working. Like I, I've been on actual. I just came off a film project. Okay, okay. For the project. Okay, weight loss crazy. Yeah, yeah. See yeah. the pics. And I got my weight. I'm gonna get my weight back a little bit. So I'm in the gym. All right. Uh, uh, it's me, Mario Van People. Okay. Uh, Ray Liotta and Lynn Whitfield. Okay. Okay. Starring an actual project and it's. It's cool. It's inspired by uh, the loss of one of my friends growing up. Cause okay. like my best friend lived across the street from me. Okay. And he actually died of cancer. And that's what inspired me to write the screenplay based on it. So you wrote it. Yeah. That's what. Hey, that's that's the big deal. So 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 I see you taking the whole acting thing very serious now. Yeah. Well, you can't like. There's no way to portray the experience of right. of losing someone that close to you. Definitely. Outside of you, you know, investing yourself into the project for right. real, like, and and the, the process. I, I kind of went through this thing where I was trying to emulate what he looked like to me. Gotcha. At that point, and, and that's what kind of helped me continue to work to lose the weight because I had a short time period. Like, okay. On those other projects with like Tom Hanks in Philadelphia and right. Christian Bell, they had like huge windows of time that they could well, increase in weight. Right, right, right. And I had to do it during my UK tour. How long? Now, how long? How long was you actually on that diet? Nine weeks. Nine weeks. Yeah, like the third week, it was crazy for me. It got hard for me to. To just the function, because I had previously been on liquids for six weeks when I got okay. shot. Okay. I shot in the face, my jaw right. broke, I had my mouth wired up. So after I got to the third week, it, it just was it was really hard to, to focus. Forget that you spent money. <laughs> I already know. Forget yeah. anything. You're like, yo, I'm gonna eat that. <laughs> I'm gonna eat that. Trust me, look, look. I just dropped 45 on P90X myself, so I know yeah. that night, that 90 days was crazy yeah. over there. So, 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 when does the uh, movie actually come out? Well, the movie will be out later this year. Okay. You know okay. What I mean, so we're going through. They're finishing up the editing process because they had already started editing the first half of the film. I got you. Got you. You know, and I came back to shoot the last half. Okay. 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 Well, check this out, man. First day of the tour. When can we get another Fifty Cent project? Well, I'm working on it now. You know, and I, I won't offer it until I feel like I perfected it with the best material. Period. Okay. Okay. You because know, what I've done in the past is I stayed on the shot clock. Right. So it's like every time they need, they pass me the ball, shoot, make us the money, Phil. Right. Every time, and then like on the last record, it was uh, me. My interest in film ended up hurting me in music. Okay. Okay. Because okay. I wrote, produced, and directed before I self destruct, and I was putting the DVD into the actual album packaging. Gotcha. Because I wanted everyone to get a chance to see it. They had to ship the record earlier for manufacturing, mm -hmm. and they lost it. So gotcha. when it got out, it was like. Four weeks before the actual release, the album is already all over the place. And, and my real fans, you'll see it tonight. Okay. Tonight, oh, I'm looking forward to it. Saying because they have the record. Okay. They just didn't buy it. Got you. Got you. They know the words. They know all the words. They know the all. Hey, well, check this out, man. I ain't gonna hold you up, brother. I had to come see you. Thank you very much. Any any words for your people in Detroit? In Detroit? Oh man, I'm here, baby. I hope you can check me. If not, you know we do it next time. Him, I just got off the phone with him. Uh oh. He called. You know, he on baby watch. <laughs> so he couldn't come out tonight, but we was trying to get it done tonight, you know, from the show. So expect when, you know, he out here, if I'm available for me to come through and do something. There it is, man. I told you I was going to get backstage and fuck with 50. Top 1027. Good looking out, Phil.